Okay, for the last one, we're going to be looking at molar mass. Uh, yeah, that's better. All right, last one, we're going to look at molar mass. So in order for us to do molar mass, we're going to find both these elements on the periodic table, and we're going to add up the masses of each of these. So if we look at these, we have Na and we have Br. We have one Na and one Br. For our masses, Na is 22.99. Br is 70.90. So let's write those down. And Br is 70.90. So we're multiplying by 1 because there is no number here. We think of this as 1 here and 1 here. These are where we're getting these numbers here. So 1 Na, 1 Br, these numbers here are our atomic mass from your periodic table. Okay, so this is going to not change these numbers. So we're just going to add these two together. 22.99 plus 79.90. We're going to get 102.89. And then units, grams per mole. All right. So that's the first one. All right, let's look at the second one here. We have PBSO4. So PB, again, this is together because it's two letters, uppercase and lowercase. This lets you know that they're together. All right, uh, S and O. We have one PB, one S, and four Os. So remember, these numbers that we're getting here, we have 1 PB, 1 PB, 1 S, 1 S, and 4 O's. So these are where we're getting our numbers. Let's look up our periodic table. So PB lead is here, 207.2. Sulfur is here, 32.07. And oxygen is here, 16.00. So we multiply this out, we're going to get 64.00, 32.07, and then 207.20. So if we add these up, we just do the first digit, uh, 207 plus 32 plus 64. So we'll get 303.27 grams per mole. And this would be our correct mass. All right, um, next one, we have to read the parentheses. So when we see these parentheses, the two outside multiplies everything inside the parentheses. So if we're reading this, we have CA, we have one CA. O, we have two O's. And H, we have two H's. All right, so if we look at this, the second one we have here for H, we have two H's. So then we're going to look at our periodic table. Calcium is 40.08. Oxygen, we get 16.00. And hydrogen is 1.01. 1 .01. So we'll multiply this out. 2 times 16, we get 32. And 2 times 1.01, we get 2.02. So if we add this up, this is going to be 1.0, or 0 0.10, um, 7, 4. So 74.10 grams per mole. OK. <clears throat> so with the parentheses, multiply everything inside. Like we said, numbers outside the parentheses multiply everything inside. All right, so let's look at the last bit for this. Um, we have something similar here. Let's look at um, one like this one here. So here, if we're reading this, we have Fe. We have 3Fe. P 
2 times 1 gives us 2p. Okay, O. 2 times 4 gives us 8O. So these are where we're getting the numbers from. For inside, we multiply times 2, each of the ones on the inside. All right, and then we just look at our masses. Uh, iron is 55.85. Uh, Phosphorus is 30.97. And auction is 16.00. So let's multiply these out. We're going to do 3 times 55.85. 3 times 55.85. So we're at 167.55. We do 2 times 32.0. Uh, this phosphorus is 97. 32.97 times 2. So we'll have 65.94. And then the last one, 8 times 16. So give us 128.00. So you can add those up and you'll get your final answer. So I'll let you guys add them up and you can get your answer.